What is up everybody, this is Easy, Easy Street Gaming, bring you a brand new Brutal Age video. This is on the new 5 star partner, The Bape. The Bape. Don't really know what that name means. <laughs> maybe Baboon, Ape, maybe just a badass ape, I don't know. Uh, got a couple of replays with them. Have, have a couple of guys, have one, I, I know of one guy in 323 that had one, one in 414. So we got, got kind of lucky and got a few replays right away. First one is on the red red vape. They uh, this this is going to be a huge partner. He's got this one skill. It's called inspiration, and just just that one skill, inspiration. It does. It has like a, a immunity for itself. Uh, two two rounds of enduring healing for the rest of the party, and retaliation. So that's one skill. Uh, the enduring healing. Now this is this is not a maxed out um, hero yet. But it was still doing like twelve or fourteen hundred healing for each each round. Uh, I think it was doing like nineteen hundred or two thousand himself. <clears throat> and um, before every attack, kind of like the Blue Nomad, before every single attack, he was healing himself up. Um, he he uses the retaliate, and I don't know what the percentage is on it exactly. I, I, we'll show it at the end of the video. I got some more stats on the end of the video. But it seemed like he was doing a lot of the retaliates in this in this first match here. Made quick work of him. The second one is from Zeus from 414. He used Saya and Bull. And on the first, and, and that, that one right there is going to be the blue bape. And that's a kind of funky looking skill. Bape. <laughs> I'm kind of getting the first look at it now too. Yeah, it looks like Zeus, he used the Sire War Pattern to enhance the stun effect and bash, which is his first skill. And uh, I think it's like a 25% chance to get the stun on on, the, on bash. So with Sire, you add another 25% on top of that. So half the time, he, there's, he's stunning. He's stunning. <laughs> and if you look at it, we slowed it down a little bit so you can kind of see exactly what he's doing play by play. And... and by looking at the stats, it looked like Zeus had left hand speed, attack percentage on the helmet, right hand hit point percentage. Just but just looking at what he's had so far, again, it's not maxed out. I think it's like level 25 or 28, 29, something like that. I don't know. And also, some, something else though to think about with the retaliation skill, the E in war, war pattern may work well because look what look how good it, it, it works on the Red Nomad. I mean, Red Nomad can solo Thera by, by himself because of the war pattern. So in this match, and this was a long match, I, I, what I did is I had it on, on one, in the play speed one at first because I, I wanted to see everything, and then it lasted forever. I didn't realize it was a level two Thera, and uh, so then I kind of sped it up a little bit halfway through. So we're not going to have to sit through the level one and watch them do the same thing over and over. But I was definitely impressed. This is not, this is, I don't know, I'll tell you, this is not going to be a weak uh, hero. This is going to be, uh, the dev team's going to have to have a real close look at this to balance the game out. If not, then you may have, a, anyone that has two or three of them will have a big advantage. Because all of their, all of his skills are, are really, really good. I mean, one skill, Enduring Healing, Retaliation. Uh, those are both that uh, and and immunity himself. So it was pretty strong So if you click on the little partner emblem in, in your inside your base and you click on the brood X guide 
I think that's what it's called. I still haven't figured that out yet. You click on the Brood X. It describes Bape as a five-star partner with the ability to inflict powerful counters and to control the enemy. I believe the control of the enemy is the stun on, on that first uh, on his first skill. Yeah, his first skill is Bash, and then uh, the buff is the Enduring Healing, and of course the counter attack comes with. Uh, with inspiration which is his second skill his main skill and he has taunt and I still haven't really figured out the entire um, makeup of taunt exactly exactly what it does I, I know uh, matter of fact I've asked around exactly what taunt is and I've heard a few different things uh, someone had told me that taunt is it slows down the enemy and his ability to uh, regain his uh, his his skills, so that would slow down the CD somehow. Um, so I'm gonna look into that a little more. But he does the taunt, and with taunt, he also recovers his own hit points. So you see that you see that at the beginning of every single one of his rounds, you'll see the, the hit points come back to him. And taunt is not a CD skill; it's something that he does all the time. So he's con so Blue's constantly taunting the enemy, uh, regaining his own hit points. And then his, then he has really, he just has two other skills. One is the bash, and then the, the other is inspiration. Inspiration is for the blues when he's clapping over his hand, uh, his hands over his head, and uh, he gives the whole team uh, hit points and gives himself immunity. So because he gives himself immunity, that this might be another good partner to use the Thera war pattern as a support war pattern uh, behind either uh, Saya or the Ian war pattern. And again, I don't have any of the bait so I haven't used it myself I'm just going off of what I've watched what I've uh, you know I've, I've tried to spend a little bit of time figuring out all this out I don't really like being wrong every time <laughs> I have I've slowed down the, the film a little bit as I was editing this video and it looks as if at level 29 which is what the blue bape is he is doing it the the heal that he was doing on himself is right around 1600 and his normal attack is around 1300 and then his uh, critical rate attack is 1635 or something like that so that's and again that's not maxed out that's that's not even level 30 yet so we get him up to level 40 I can see this being a 2500 heal and 3,000 damage to, to 5,000 damage so not an overpowering uh, not an overpowering attack uh, necessarily, but because it's the, because he has the counter attack and he's going to be getting more attacks in, and he heals himself at the beginning of every one of the counters. That's that's a big part of his ability. Uh, again, just like the Red Nomad, that can keep himself alive. The more the more he gets attacked, it seems like the better he does. So very interesting. But because of the time, let's fast forward through the rest of this uh, this attack right here. They do end up taking out a level two Thera first try, so that's pretty good. What I want to do is I want to go and get into all three colors. We don't, I don't have examples of all three colors. Uh, I only have a red, red and blue, but I do have some of the stats for green, and I kind of I kind of uh, enlarged it all so we can take a look at them all. Again, now we'll start off with blue. His first ability is Bash, and that is. 25% chance to stun the enemy for one round and if you you see here I guess they expect us to get a lot of them because it, it goes all the way up to level 7 so that will take 7 uh, Bapes to get him up there his second ability is inspiration. This is his biggest one It applies a counter and immunity to itself. That's for two rounds and then enduring healing for the rest of the team for two rounds and I know that he was healing himself at that 1600 uh, rate but I don't I never did really catch what he was healing the rest of the team for or how much it was so something else to look 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 at um, once you get yours and then there's taunt and you can see here there's no CD on this at all so that means it's always in effect it's happening all the time it, he can uh, taunt the enemy for two rounds when attacking and recover 10% of his hit points each round so I don't even know what that means because if you do if it's the skills always on you can taunt for two rounds I don't know if it stacks. I, I don't know. So of course, I'm not exactly um, an expert on knowing 
Uh, it looks like Green has the same first ability bash. Uh, his second ability or skill, whatever you, uh, it's called the Leap Strike, and this is actually another really interesting attack. Uh, he attacks all enemies. And I believe if it's a critical attack, it extends the CD of all enemies. That means they can't go, they can't come back and, and attack right away. And then he also has taunt as well. So not exactly the same as blue. He does have, he has a leap attack where blue has the, uh, what was it called? See, I forget already. Inspiration. So I, now, so if you ask me, it seems as if blue will be a little stronger than green. I don't know that that leap attack and delaying for one round doesn't seem quite as good as inspiration where he's uh, doing the counter attack and, and, and all that now red has the same he, he has bash and he has inspiration so he has the first two abilities are the same that means red is gonna have that powerful uh, retaliation attack and oh here's where the critical rate thing comes in so forget what I said about green <laughs> it ha he, it's club mastery once a critical rate attack occurs uh, it will reduce the action bar for the enemy and increase the action bar for himself. So basically what that means is that's a 20% buff for speed for him and a nerf for the other team. And that's another effect the whole team. So that's another, I mean, red is going to be a, a really strong uh, hero. And if you saw that little flash from 5 to 6 star, the 5 star was like 5,000 hit points, goes up to 7,000 hit points for red. So that's a pretty big boost for between 5 and 6 star. So, tough, tough hero. Got a new partner coming out for Christmas, Rudolph. Rudolph, the female reindeer. It's going to be interesting. It's very valuable and exclusive. Probably cost about three grand if you wanted it. <laughs> so, hope you enjoyed the video. Got a lot of cool stuff happening. New, new partner, Bape. Crazy name. Kind of funky looking dude, but super strong. So, leave, leave comments down in the comment section. Appreciate everyone for watching. Thanks for subbing to the channel. Till next time, it's been easy. Take care, everybody.